Welcome back to another episode of The Last Boy Scouts. We're still here in Morro Bay, California, checking out some of the different trails that they have in the area in Morro Bay State Park. Today, we're gonna hit the Quarry Trail, just a short distance away from the Morro Bay campground up in the foothills. And we're gonna see what this 1.1 mile of trail has to offer. From wildlife to different species of plant life, we'll see what we got and we're gonna bring the boys along for the ride. So stay tuned, it's gonna be a good one. about in some of our previous episodes um, I showed off what the uh, sticky monkey flower is that's what this orangish flower is that's very prevalent here in this region as well more poison oak we got it back in here and back in this way all right we got more of the chaparral and a mix of other different stuff see uh, you can see uh, predominantly with some of this poison oak, the leaves will also turn red for the Pacific um, type of poison oak. All right, we spotted something awesome here along the trail. Right here we have some uh, red berry bramble. Oof. And uh, yeah, it's prickly on its vine. But um, very easily identifiable by its uh, also leaves of three. But um Pretty awesome. You got it right up in here. Different berry bramble.
we come to a point in a trail where we need to stop, we need to take a break, water in, water out, or just get out of the sun, get some shade so we don't overheat. So first thing I'm gonna do when I stop for any reason is I'm gonna remove my pack or anything that's kind of weighing me down, overheating me, maybe shed some extra layers of clothes. But sometimes when we stop, we don't wanna leave our equipment on the ground, so we need to look for a way to put up our gear so that it's not getting a bunch of wigglers and critters up in it, okay? So the first thing I'm always gonna look for is something natural, like a notch or just something sticking out of the tree to where I can just hang it up. But we don't always have that luxury. So there's a couple different ways that we can hang up our pack to keep it off the ground. One, like I mentioned, is we can look for a notch. We can look for something to just simply put it up, right? We can look for dead branches if the notch isn't already created. Maybe pull out our handy dandy tool, whatever it may be, a saw, a pocket knife, trim a little bit off, hang it right up. Our next option will be to look for a nice sized stick, about eh, two, three feet, okay? Utilizing the tree. Uh, the arms of our pack, right? You can simply just hang it up. And cinch it tight. Right? Okay. Maybe it will work better if you have another branch hanging out to where this can just simply sit on it or another notch. But either way, I think you get the point. It's gonna sit, it's not gonna touch the ground, it's away from the critters, it's away from the wigglers. All right, the next one. Utilizing one of our 10 C's, cordage, I'm gonna make a simple bowline. The way we make a bowline is we make a loop feed in our line around back through the hole and send you back down All right and there you go simple bowline okay now i'm going to take this loop and a short stick. Wrap it around, feed it through, and simply put my stick or toggle, or you want to refer it to. We have this loose thing. If I pull down on this, it's going to come out. We're going to tie one more knot referred to as a clove hitch. In order to make a clove hitch, I'm just going to do a simple half hitch around and back through. Right? All right. Once again. We got our toggle in there, right? And this is the portion where we're gonna hang our pack. Using the top hanging portion of my pack. And there we go. We got ourselves a hanger. Now you can do this same thing, this same method, with a longer, larger piece of stick. And rather than this top portion, this handle, this hanger that may or may not be on your pack, depending on what type of pack you have, the longer stick or branch, you can just simply put your backpack straps or your pack straps over the handle and you got yourself something to secure your pack. All right, 
we're gonna conclude this video here we're headed out of here we made our hike up the trail i'll be sure to leave pictures and notes within this video of some of the wildlife and some of the plant life that we discovered here now before i get myself in a bind rubbing up against this poison oak i'm gonna end it here so stay safe stay vigilant knowledge is your weapon be prepared see you guys next time Thanks for tuning in to another episode of The Last Boy Scouts. If you like what you see, hit that like button. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more from The Last Boy Scouts Survival and Bushcraft.